Hey guys, I'm Kiriko. Welcome back to the Long Dark VR, uh, VR in the vehicle. Yes, indeed, I don't know why I'm speaking like that, but we're in the vehicle and trying to spot any and all wolves around here. Don't see any right now, so I'm gonna keep on moving. Oh, where you at, buddy? Where you at? I don't know where you at, but I would appreciate not to tackle with you. If I could actually spot you. Where the hell are you? He's stalking me. There he is. There he is. There you at, buddy. There you at. You stay there, son. And I'm gonna go into this vehicle. Yes. So, I'm playing the new update. The December update, and the wolves are still annoying. Okay. Yes, I will take it. The wolves are still annoying, especially this dude who is just, you know, coming coming right for us. They're coming right for us. Could you, could you not, dude? Seriously. Yeah, well, we found gloves, and they are in terrible condition, but it's better than nothing. And I'm kinda stuck in this uh, car right now. Kinda freaking stuck. I would like to... Well, I'm gonna freeze to death if I pass time for one more hour in here. Well, Wolf will have to do something about us then. Chill, buddy. Okay, I did not want to waste my flare, but I'm gonna do it. I am gonna do it. If I knew that you were this far away already, I might not have done it. But I'm still gonna do it. Okay, buddy? Okay, son? You stay there. Can I open the trunk? No, I can't. Is there anything in the back seats? Don't seem to be. Let's go into front then. Let's open things up. Nothing. I can't see him, but I guess he's gonna come for me somewhere around here. I'm gonna leave the vehicle there. Where are you at, son? Where are you at? I don't know. Ah, oh, there you at. You stay there, son, okay? You stay there. Don't want to deal with you, okay? Just be there, buddy. We're gonna into the Milton. We go into the Milton, and you should stay there, for we are freezing to death. And you don't want to go in my way. So, um, if I can get him to stay at a reasonable and respectable distance, then I can make my way downtown. And uh, hopefully not meet more wolves along the way. Would you mind not running at me, buddy? Did they recolor them? I think, I think he's like different color, more grayer than usual. He could be. I don't know. Let's see if the... Grey mother is home, which I doubt she is. Would you stop running at me, please? Dude, beware. Town of Milton. Welcome. Welcome to Town of Milton. Stop it, you. Stop it, I says. Stop it. Dude, stop it. You stay there. No? You keep your distance. Do not sprint at me. That was stupid. That was stupid. You stay there. You stay there, son. I'm going up here. I'm going up here to the Grey Mother's house. Goodbye. <sighs> okay. Two flares down. But we got rid of him. And this is actually a warm place. Five degrees. Good. We are safe. <sighs> Grey Mother, what happened to you? What happened to you, dear old lady? You actually have some cloth over here. A metal pot. There is nothing cooking in there. Unfortunately, we do have a fireplace. So this could be like a great place to set up town now. That the Grey Mother is actually gone. Oh well, she has some curtains. We can strip down for cloth. And um... Another baseball cap, huh? Great. We can strip down for cloth if I could find a repair kit. Or maybe some scrap metal and make a hook. And maybe a line. If I could find that, that would be great. So we can start doing some repairs. Because all of my clothing is kind of garbage. Kind of garbage right now. Let's turn on the radio. Hmm, maybe not. Maybe not then. No, cardboard box is empty. We have a granola bar. More cloth over here. Nothing on the floor. I wonder what happened to Grey Mother in uh, the sandbox mode. Empty freezer and a fridge. Give me something. Empty fridge. Well, isn't that lovely? Cotton scarf. This might be better than. Not really. 
but maybe if repaired yeah I'm gonna actually wear it sure that's fine wear the scarf get me more scarves I don't really like a baseball cat cat I'm gonna take the charcoal just so we can do some mapping of the area because reasons right because reasons more showed us nor cabinet empty alrighty then let's hope grandmother actually left some food behind although because we had to search for the food for her I doubt she had much and I guess anyone that came after her just dusted her and took all her stuff I'm guessing uh, I would like to find maybe some uh, bullets for my gun I mean grandmother had a gun so it would be it would be normal to have some bullets in her house maybe hidden away somewhere maybe possibly we'll see everything is empty though. even the trash can even the trash can oh wilderness kitchen that's good cardboard box there's nothing in it and there's a tomato soup so they did leave some food behind whoever came after gray mother I uh, appreciate it nothing up there alrighty then some cloth that I might wreck at some point Sure, I'm getting hungry and I'm getting thirsty, so let's just drop another soda in my belly. Nom nom nom. And then let's go up the stairs. Let's go up the stairs. What do you have in here? Nothing. Nothing in the here. I've never really properly searched her house, I think, so uh, I don't even know what to expect. But I know I can expect some water. Yes, give me all the water. We might say, Coco, why are you taking water from the toilet? Well, let me tell you all about the glory of water that you don't need to cook yourself. Because water gets cooked. Don't. You, you should know that. Crunchy stuff, card box. Nothing in there, though. It's unfortunate. Some, uh... Well, actually, a lot of papers. We can use this. We can use this, so... Everything that a man can use, a man should take. Crate. Is there anything in the crate? Oh, I can actually step on this. It's cool. There's some cloth that I can get. Nothing really awesome and amazing over here. Sad. Sadly. Ah, another book. Grandmother, you did not leave much behind, did you? Well, this is uh, like a nice bed I can sleep in. That's good. Trunk. Maybe something in the trunk? Nothing in the trunk. More curtains that's good oh yeah sewing kit that's exactly what I needed sport socks I need to check what are my other socks like uh, I have double wool socks which is amazing so I'm gonna keep those on wool socks are like the greatest socks yeah yeah you should have them you should wear them even they might be itchy Ooh, sweater don't mind if I do don't mind if I do look at this it's so good also she looks badass you gotta admit that she looks badass is hell I think there should be another room somewhere over here on this side right oh, I've searched this okay yeah there's the room uh, I think this is her room oh this is so sad this is so sad everyone and everything is gone I'm definitely taking the work books work boots <laughs> not books and also wearing them. Everything needs to be repaired. God damn it. Everything is such a bad condition. Um, I mean, it's fine. I understand. Is there something over here? It's just a splotch. Splotch of something. I don't know if splotch is even a word. But I, I'm calling it splotch. Cotton took. I'm taking you and I'm comparing you to cotton scarf. I think it should be better. Yeah, it should be. Wear it. Let's go. Now this is the room we have plenty of daylight left we're slowly getting warmer and I think it's time we try to repair some stuff right and for repairing some stuff one will need some cartons 10 minutes for two cloth don't mind if I do I'm gonna take it it sounds very windy out there so uh, I think it's perfect for a maintenance day right now yeah just to get things going and repair my stuff as much as I can. I don't necessarily want to repair it like fully. Because reasons. Okay, actually wind died down a bit. And probably the wolf went away. 
hopefully back where we came where he came from or well we came from doesn't really matter right we both came from the same place same place same time mr wolf same place same time oh loady doody i am so hyped to be recording this again it's just so awesome just so awesome playing this yes i mean it's been like uh i don't know it's not even been a week since the last long dark episode it's been like two days yeah in between but still <laughs> well as you guys are gonna be watching this it's gonna be more than two days but you know you know what i mean but yeah i'm still very excited to be playing the new update can't go this way i need to go the other way i'm gonna go check uh behind her house because in the story mode there's i believe a hatchet back here so it would stand to reason that there's a chance for the hatchet to spawn back here as well so i'm certainly doing that we do need some kind of a weapon or a tool to protect us there's a whetstone so that is a good start search the drawers charcoal well okay hacksaw i'll take it i'll take the hacksaw it's better than nothing it's better than nothing there's some old man's beard over there don't mind if i take that don't mind if i take that now as i said i never played the story mode enough to actually leave the whole place leave this uh, region so uh i don't know that much about it uh looks like this is closed off but i do know some things about it so i'm gonna search out the milton place if i remember correctly which i don't think i can remember correctly uh, where the flare gun can be found in the story mode we we gonna go check there if the flare gun can be found at the same place so wood for me how warm is in here it's seven okay i'm just hoping to find uh one of the like torso clothing over here that that would bring us enough warmth to be safe to go around a bit more right right nothing special over here what about the microwave nothing i do think that we might want to make our base in the old lady's house just because it's it's such a good house you know you have a fireplace there you have basically everything nice uh nice room to sleep in and uh, all that kind of great stuff right right also if there could be any food there you go ask for it and you shall receive i want to say also if there's any food that would be great and as i was saying that we got the food I'm not using my hacksaw to get uh, scrap metal right now, for I do not need it. I did say I'm gonna do repairs, but if I can uh, spend my daytime just searching the houses close by, that is also great. Yeah, I'm not sure I can carry much more. Are we there yet, my lady? Yeah, you already over encumbered. Well, that's very unfortunate. I guess a lot of it is. Oh, why is it red now? Why are we on red now? It used to be white, now we're in red. There's a towel we can rip apart for clothing that... <clears throat> uh, I mean, for cloth that I do not necessarily need since there's plenty in the other house. Rancid venison. I'm gonna take it. <laughs> we are there where we eat rancid stuff. Don't you worry about it. I'm gonna cook it. We might not be the greatest cooks, but I'm gonna cook it. Oh, toys. That's sad. That is extremely sad. That is very sad. Dude, if this was like a kid sitting in there, a dead one, that would be like the worst thing ever. Dress shirt. I don't think that's exactly what we were looking for, but I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna see. Uh, compared to the plate shirt, it is better for wind chill, worse otherwise. Uh, maybe if it was repaired, it would be better. It's definitely not better than the sweater. So I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it. I did not expect it to be actually better than the plate shirt, but it looks like it might be, especially for wind chill, which is which is good. And also surprising at the same time. Let's just move through the town, see which houses we can enter, see which houses we can search as we have the daylight. Mm -hmm. We're probably gonna spend a couple of days here in Milton searching uh, like the, the town and than the rest around just because i do want to find some uh, good stuff over here and then i'm going to try to find a way to leave the whole place that's also going to be interesting for i do not know how to leave the place and 
which way are we gonna go? Um, for Lord Noskik or Mr. Lake, doesn't really matter. We're gonna go somewhere. Excuse me, what is this up here? Oh, it's just a brush. For a second there, I thought it might be something with a razor edge, but it does not have a razor-like edge. Line, thank you very much, that's exactly what we're looking for. All I need is uh, some scrap metal now, which we can get since we do have a hacksaw. I don't want to like destroy the metal shelf though, because it's gonna just take some a long time, and we're gonna get more than we want. And the reason is, I wanna have a fishing hook. I wanna make it either for repairing of my clothing or possible fishing, which I don't think it's possible in Milton, but I'm not sure it might be. And uh, if not in Milton, well, there's gonna be more areas that we can do. I actually want to get my ass down to uh, Pleasant Valley and the Coastal Highway because both of those regions had some areas updated. I know that Kunset Garage has been updated and uh, I know that the Pleasant Valley town area, I think that's around where the where the shop is. It's like burned out place. Uh, those those two areas were updated, so we do want to check them out eventually, right? Eventually, we're gonna get our asses over there. But until then, let's see what lies in this here Milton. Nothing in the cars, that's very fortunate. Anything in this vehicle? Vehicle? Not in the vehicle? Alrighty then. There's a flare! Well, that's gonna definitely come in handy since uh, I wasted the other one. We probably can't enter the back right here. No. Hello, car. Do you have anything in here? Uh, I gotta be wary of wolves because I know they can be between these houses and it might be too late before you spot them. Before they charge you. So, really appreciate if that didn't happen. Let's go check if you have something in the back. Not really. And what about trunk? Can I open it? No. Okay. Do not see any wolves currently. Do not hear any wolves currently. Just a start. Also, I'm stuck. There's crows somewhere. There's probably a dead deer or something around here. I know that in story mode there was one. Let's be careful. Nothing here. Nothing down the line. That's actually amazing not seeing any wolves right now it's making me happy let's go check up the post office let's see what we can find there right right let's go check it out search the post office and then i'm probably gonna swing back to the home and deposit what i've found so far right right anything in here excuse me nothing all righty now, I do realize that uh, the long dark is... Ooh, coffee. Awesome. Come is kind of different than the other games I play. And, uh, you know, Dust Lead gets less views than usual. Shooting guide. Awesome. So, I really do appreciate anyone uh, who comments and watches me. And it's really amazing, you guys. All of your support so far. I like you. I really do. I really love you guys. You make this possible for me. And... Yeah, I'm, I'm very happy to do this. I'm very hyped to actually do this, to play the new update and to find the moose and possibly hunt it down and hopefully not get hunted down by a moose as well. Right? Right. Okay, this does not look like there's anything in here. Uh, I wish at some point there would be an option to rip down the Canada flag and then burn it as a, as a fire fuel or something. <laughs> I'm just joking. I don't have anything against Canada. I would actually like to visit at some point since I do like snow. I do like uh, more northern climates. I really do. So I would like to visit at some point. I do not mean to be disrespectful by that. I was just saying it would be funny if they allowed that to do this. Because I think that the survival in this situation, survivor, would actually go do that even though he was he or her. Uh, he or she, not her. I'm stupid were Canadian, right? They would definitely do it if it was for their survival purposes. But yeah, I can see why it's not happening right now. Alrighty then, I think back there there's like a pond area where you can find rabbits as well. I think so, if I remember correctly. Uh, let's actually pop into this car and maybe the other one over there before I finish the episode. 
but I'm kind of on schedule today because I still have more recording to do. Today is the day. It's Friday for me. Uh, for you guys, this is going to be Nobody probably Monday. Uh, where me and the guys, Nemo and Zen, are recording our uh, Don't Starve Together uh, episode. So I still have a bunch of recording to be done later on today. So fun times. More driving gloves. Don't mind if I do. I'm going to take them. I'm gonna take them. Anything in the back? Nothing in the back. Alrighty then. Uh, back here? No. Crimes a pry bar. Okay then. I'm actually gonna open the hood as well over here so I know which cars have I searched yet or well already. Okay, let's pop in there so I can save the game and I'm gonna say thank you everyone for watching. I do hope you enjoyed it. It really means a lot to me as I said before that you guys are watching this. It really means a lot to me if you guys can share this because of course YouTube is kind of silly and since I'm a small YouTuber doesn't really want to share uh, my videos with the rest with others so uh, anytime you guys share it means really a lot and I'm really thankful. So yeah, thanks for watching now. Do your magic and I'll see you next time. Kirk out.